It's a little hat that is made with a big heart. A group of East Texas women are doing what they can to help bring awareness to the number one killer of Americans, congenital heart defects. It's also the most common type of birth defect in the country. We got to meet the ladies about their labor of love. We're going to take this needle and thread it into the... Oh, we just kind of weave it into... Whether you knit, crochet, or use the loom, these ladies at Shiloh Road Church of Christ come together with a mission in mind. Their efforts are part of a fairly new campaign in conjunction with the American Heart Association and the Children's Heart Foundation to collect little red hats. I just want new parents to be aware of the heart defects in these newborn babies because as soon as they can get help, that that's what it's all about. We want them to be healthy. The group Sisters in Service began making these red hats back in March. Since then, they've been able to create more than 320 of them. The little red hats will be delivered in February during American Heart Association Month to the maternity wards at ETMC and Christus Trinity Mother Francis. Congenital heart disease affects one in 100 babies. About 25% are considered the complicated disease that ends up needing surgery. ETMC cardiothoracic surgeon Andrea Cooley did an advanced fellowship at Children's Medical Center in Dallas dealing with congenital heart disease in babies. Cooley has seen firsthand the critical role of prenatal care and screenings. The youngest patient with a heart problem she has worked on was only 16 minutes old. Luckily, the patient's mom had screening and so they knew this was coming. So we could have the day of the C-section, the time, and the entire OR team ready as soon as that baby was delivered. Um, so we were able to save that baby. The hats made with love are all different patterns, with some made for larger babies down to the little preemies. The sisters in service hope this serves as a small reminder that heart disease affects our little ones too. A small way to make a big impact in the fight against heart disease. Little Hats Big Hearts began in Chicago back in 2014 and thanks to thousands of volunteers across the country, Little Hats Big Hearts is now in 39 states and counting. For more information about the Little Hats Big Hearts project, including how to register for the program, just head on over to our websites, KLTV or KTRE.com. Click on that big red box and there you will find a link called Little Hats Big Hearts.